Hello everyone, my name is x Rhodes, and I wanted to do a little something. I know I haven't been doing a whole lot of FNAF content lately, my content has been going over the Sonic side lately, so I do kind of apologize for that, but I'm bringing it back. For the most part. So, I wanted to do this thing where I tried to do impersonations of FNAF voices. Now... I don't know how well I will do, so give your ratings of my FNAF voices in the comments below, and see some and give some um, advice because these voices are going to be terrible, which is a warning. Anything that I will give these voices will some for well in occasions will be terrible, and yes, I'm doing all the FNAF voices. Even the ones that I hate. <sighs> okay. As... W I will also give out my opinions on the voices after I do my impersonations of them. Well, before I do it. Anyways, let's do it. Okay, so I think Freddy's voice is solid. Um... And uh, credit to Andrew John 100 for the footage, but yeah, let's do this. <sighs> when you wake up, just remember, friends are forever. Like that? Like that? All right, let's let's move on. Foxy's voice definitely a definitely an awesome one. Let's do it. Yeah! Never underestimate the cunning of a pirate. Or a fox, for that matter. Toys for a Toy Freddy voice, a pretty solid one. It's not my fault. I have these pla uh, these fat plastic fingers that I can't press the buttons. The voice line it. The line is a bit inaccurate, I'm sorry. A lot of people really don't like Toy Bonnie's voice, and I can understand why, but I didn't really but I don't really hate it. It's though I can see the the improvement. Anyway. This neck this next part is totally, totally gonna hurt. God, that's God. That voice kind of kind of sucks, actually. Yeah. Wow. I I am sorry. Anyways, let's anyways let's go. Uh, Toy Chica's voice also pretty good. Um. Okay. You won't get tired of dying, will you? Wow. Wow. My person. Wow. My my acting is kind of terrible today. Wow. Mangle's voice is awesome. I really like it, although it not as much as Foxy's. Oh god, this is gonna be so hard. Don't be afraid. Soon you will look just like me. Beautiful. The puppet's voice, I think it's okay, at the very least. I think it's fitting for the character, but I c And it is somewhat creepy. Yeah, I overall like it, for the most part. But it just doesn't stand out compared to the others. I will give them massive props for, for putting in an insane amount of effort, though. <sighs> My god, this is gonna be so weird, though. Seeing you powerless is like music to me. Oh my god. Oh my god. Alright, your thoughts? I actually really like Withered Bonnie's voice. It makes sense for the overall character, unlike another Bonnie character that we'll get into. And I think... And yes, I know it's... I know it's gonna say that... That they go to to a bit far but come on that dude's missing a face ace you would have to expect at least something like that 
a anyway, I won't be reading the first part of his line because I don't really remember it and I can't hear it that well, which is my only complaint for the voice, but I don't know. Is it me trapped or is it you? Perhaps it's us both. Oh my god. I I I I, I hate doing this. <laughs> All right, let's move on. I I, I like Wither Chica's voice. It it's okay for what it is and it does make sense for the character. Although the mo although the modulators are a bit strange, which is going to be very hard to do. Okay. I waited out of the vent, and now we are together. I'm sorry. I love Springtrap's voice. I know it. W I know it wouldn't make sense. I w I know it wouldn't make sense for th for for the for the character's spring for the character's voice not to be not spoken in through FNAF 3 but because of all the rough times that William has had and you can tell that he, that he finally really made his mouth th through those spring locks so I'd say the voice is still awesome for what it is anyways let's do it got you <laughs> Nightmare Freddy has a sick voice. I actually prefer this voice over regular Freddy's because it's more fitting and I and I just can't hate it. Hmm, all right, let's try it. I am oh, Okay, I'm sorry. I am remade not by you, but the one you should not have killed. I love Nightmare Fred Fredbear's voice. It's very unique, and it makes sense for the overall character. But at the same time, it wasn't that hard. It didn't take me too long to impersonate it. I give it massive props for putting in a lot of effort put into it, though. Let's do this. We know who our friends are. And you are not one of them. Nightmare's voice is also really good. Sure, sure, not quite as unique as Nightmare Fredbear's, but it still makes sense for, for the overall character. And it did bring in a very iconic voice line. Anyways. You will not be spared. Another really good voice. Nightmarian's voice is is really really awesome, and it's also and it doesn't sound that hard to impersonate. And the and the voice effects make make this voice dare I say perfect. Let's see that. Let's do this. <sighs> This is a nightmare that you won't wake from. Oh, God. Nightmare BB's voice, I actually, I also really like. Nightmare BB's voice, I know some people would say that this voice would work more for Plush Trap than this character. But, I don't know, man. And the voice itself is awesome, and and because of how freaky that thing is, I can't I can excuse use the ex the problem that many people have with this voice. Well, that Andrew has with it, but anyway, right? Well, it is his opinion, so it is a, it is understandable. Well, I will say, but I I personally like it a lot. Anyways, let's do it. <clears throat> <laughs> You're not so big. Just a bite-sized mortal. <sighs> Just
Jack Ochiga's voice is also really, really good. And I know I, I know I, I thought before about Jack O'Bonnie being better than Jack Ochiga, which is a bias between me and Bonnie's being better than Chica's. But this is one of the very rare occasions where Jack Ochiga is where Chica's are better than Bonnie's. Which does come into the case with the Rockstar animatronics, but we'll get into that later. I think Jack Uchika's voice fits the character, and overall, the voice actor sounded like that she had a lot of fun doing it. Like I will right now. This is gonna be fun. Did, did things get really hot in here, or is it just me? I feel like all my nightmare animatronic voices are starting to sound similar. I, I don't know. The first voice is one of the first voices that debuted in the series. Circus Baby's voice is amazing. I may not love it as much as Nightmare Fredbear's voice or 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 Funtime Freddy's, but the voice is, stands out oh very well compared to all the others, besides from those two. And I don't know. Let's do this voice then. Looks like something bad happened. I guess you forgot about me. So sad. <laughs> Baby Bab's voice in Sister Location may be a little bit forgettable, like the character itself, but I think it's done really well and really cool. Not one of my favorites, though. Let's do this. Hello there. Ballora's voice is also pretty is also pretty cool. Not as good as Circus Baby's voice, but it definitely stands out. Save me a save me a dance for another day. My favorite voice. And many people's fan favorite voices as well. Funtime Freddy's voice is pretty sick. Anyways. Hey! I see you over there in the dark! Bon Bon! Go get him! I said, Go get him! <laughs> I don't know why I added that extra line there, but okay. Congrats, Kellen, for for an ama for a very iconic voice. Bon Bon's voice is just okay. I think it fits well for the character, but because of how forgettable Bon Bon is as a character, I don't think too much of the voice. Go back to sleep. Nobody's here. That's my voice, I guess. Oh boy, where do I begin with this ridiculous voice? Funtime Foxy's voice is good. It's very good. It fits well for the character, and it fits well for the character, but it also hurt my ears. <laughs> and I think I'm about to hurt a lot of people's ears here, too. Forgive me, Andrew. It seems that you couldn't make it to my show, so I brought the show to you! Scrap Baby's voice is just Circus Baby's voice, but with a more creepier tone. It's still awesome. Let's do this. Wanna see the scooping room? Molten Freddy's voice is actually is also pretty awesome. It's basically Funtime Freddy's voice, but with a more creepier tone, which I give massive credit for. So, yeah. Th thanks for inviting me to the party. I won't. Tr I'll try not to ruin it. Afton's voice is pretty much just Springtrap's voice, but 
but basically with different modulators with different with different tones and a different design along with a very iconic line like I always come back Okay, I just realized I that I reset that twice. I am so sorry. I apologize. Why? Basically, puppet's voice, but but a little more fitting. Shh. It'll all be over soon. If you want my honest opinion, I don't know what to feel about Funtime Chica's voice. I think the voice is fine, but it feels a tidbit forgettable. Alright. Today's all about me, me, me! <laughs> Why? I... I hate my life. Music Man's voice is very, very fitting. I love this voice a lot, and I overall all can see the appeal of it. Let's do it. You and I will be making music together for a long, long time. One of the more forgettable voices, Trash in a Gang's voice is just... Eh, uh, not bad, but just forgettable. Hey, hey, hello, hello, can you hear me? Hey, I got something to tell you. <laughs> hmm. Like the voice, but nothing more. Please deposit five coins. Please deposit five coins. <sighs> this voice right here is probably my least favorite voice in the franchise. The voice itself isn't bad, but it doesn't fit with the character design in any way. I get that it's trying to be unique, but looking at that design, I can't see it fit. Like, at all. Oh. Withered Bonnie made sense, and the... Maji... Like... Like... Voices like the Withered's... Voices like that make sense. This is... If... If this was given to a Withered animatronic, then I would like it more. It... It confuses me so much why they give... If a such a random modulated voice to such a random... Dumb animatronic that doesn't even fit with the voice. <sighs> I found my guitar. Do you see the modulators are not only not fitting for the character, but they're also kind of annoying. Uh... Rockstar Chica's voice also kind of sucks. It falls in the same problem as Rockstar Bonnie into a point where it doesn't fit with the character at all. The only thing that doesn't make it any worse than Rockstar Bonnie's is the fact that is the fact that it doesn't have of extremely weird modulators that make it annoying. And it's not that hard to do. <clears throat> That's right. And don't you come back now, you hear? She sounds like an old lady, though. Yar, how may I be in a service to ya? Rockstar or Foxy's voice is pretty cool, and my favorite voice out of the Rockstar animatronics. And overall, my favorite Rockstar animatronic out of all of them. The Rockstar animatronics don't really stand out to me because of the fact that not only their voices are pretty weak compared to the others in the franchise, but their, but their designs are also pretty generic. The only one that I... I thought made the most sense was Rockstar Foxy's, and the most unique. And one of the very few occasions where Foxy's take over Freddy's. Orville's voice is pretty good. What did you think of my act? 
Happy Frog's voice is okay. I think it's fitting for the character, but because of the fact that I wasn't a big fan of Happy Frog to begin with, my opinion on the voice isn't too strong. Not, it's not terrible though. You and I don't get to talk together that much. Mr. Hippo's voice is not only my favorite mediocre melody, but also my favorite voice out of the mediocre melodies. My friend, you have met a terrible, terrible end. Pigpatch's voice is also... It, the voice itself of is good, but it suffers from the same problem as Rockstar Chica and Rockstar Bonnie, that it doesn't fit with the character that much. But since the voice itself is a lot better than than those two and with modulators that are far from an, and without modulators i overall like the voice for the most part if you sit by the river long enough you will see the body of your enemy floating by <laughs> <laughs> Ned Bear's voice does fit with the other animatronics. However, nothing, there's nothing more to it that I can say. Other than Stranger Danger! Now we move on to the Security Reach animatronics. I, will, I would first of all give massive credits to Nick Brawler for the, for the footage, the pictures that you'll be seeing here. Anyways, you'll also be seeing the voice actors. My overall thoughts on Glamrock Freddy's voice, probably my favorite Freddy vo probably my favorite Security Breach voice, and my third favorite voice. Let's do it. Gregory, do you see that vent and below you? Have you ever heard about Among Us, Gregory? Sorry, I had to. I really had to. <laughs> Sun's voice is pretty good. Good. Moon's voice is also. Security alert! Security alert! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Nighty night. You know, despite Montgomery Gator being a, being a ripoff of Bonnie, at least his voice is pretty cool. Hey, little guy. <laughs> With Roxanne Wolf being my favorite of of being my second favorite, you would also imagine that she would have a pretty good voice, and she does. <sighs> hey, kid. And we're just trying to help. I feel like that sounds a bit similar to Ballora, though. Gregory's voice is serviceable, but nothing more. Freddy? Freddy, are you there? Vanny's voice is... is pretty damn good. It fits with the character, and it's pretty creepy. Are you, are you having fun yet? Despite Glamrock Chica being pretty weak compared to the Glamrocks, I will admit her voice is pretty good. Gregory! I tried to include animatronics only. So I did include Gregory there because there because of the theory of him being a robot. So a lot of people seem to hate that, and it's very understandable. And plus, they were the main they were the main type of characters in the they were the more main characters in the franchise. So no human characters in this, if you don't count Gregory. But whatever. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. 
I, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You know, please give a massive thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And go ahead and roast me down in the comment sections of how terrible my voices are. Because I know there's going to be some comments down below. I really, I'm pretty sure of that. With that said, thank you all for watching. And I'll see you all in the next video.